nervous system when a bus comes towards you you at once become cautious and step to one side of the road why do your legs move on seeing a bus have you asked them to move the humans have a complex body consisting of different systems various activities are performed by these systems a number of systems work together in a controlled and coordinated manner to perform any activity the nervous system in our body performs various major functions like it keeps us alert and informed about outside environment with the help of brain and sense organs our nervous system consists of brain spinal cord and sense organs with different types of nerves all nerves are ultimately made up of nerve cells and neurons neurons are the basic structure of nervous system this coordination is essential in performing any kind of work like running walking and eating etc the work of different parts of the body is coordinated by the nervous system nervous system is concerned with the reception of stimuli the transmission of nerve impulses and the activation of muscle mechanisms nerves nerves are made up of nerve fibers called neurons they are the part of peripheral nervous system the nerves help to receive and transfer the message the message which runs through a nerve is called impulse these nerves are the basic units of the nervous system each neuron can be divided into a cell body b dendrites c axon each nerve cell consists of a central portion containing the nucleus known as the cell body the dendrites are short extensions of the cell body and are involved in the reception of stimuli the axon is usually a single elongated extension it is specially important in the transmission of nerve impulses from the region of the cell body to other cells the nerves in the body are of three types one sensory nerves carry impulses from the different receptor organs to the central nervous system brain or spinal cord two motor nerves carry impulses from central nervous system to the glands and muscles of the receptor organs three intermediate nerves they connect sensory nerves and motor nerves gap between the two nerves is called synapse there are about 1 lakh 30000 crore nerve cells in the human body transmitting messages at speed of 290 kilometers per hour brain brain is the vital and delicate part of the central nervous system it is situated within the skull brain controls the vital activities for the survival of human the main parts of a brain are cerebrum cerebellum and medulla oblongata parts of brain their structure and functions cerebrum largest part of the brain it has ridges and furrows it consists of right and left halves responsible for memory thinking intelligence sensation of pain touch and sight taste smell and hearing etc cerebellum smaller egg shaped found at the back of the skull responsible for muscular action balance of the body medulla oblongata it is the base of the brain it is the link between the brain and spinal cord controls breathing heartbeat digestive system and other involuntary functions spinal cord it is a long cord 
which arises from the base of the skull. It runs backwards through the vertebral column and extends up to the tail and is protected by the bones of the vertebral column. Spinal cord receives impulses from the brain and sends them to muscles and internal organs. It is also the center of many reflex actions.